The Cloquet Area Fire District, not department, but district, serves portions of Carleton County, St. Louis County, and contracts with the Fond du Lac Band. The unique model provides fire and EMS services to communities that might otherwise struggle to do so. Now, right now, fire districts don't get state or federal funding, but as Northern News Now's Jack Wiedner explains, that could soon change. Fire districts serve regions rather than cities, allowing smaller communities to combine their resources. But according to Cloquet Fire District Chief Jesse Buse, it also poses some obstacles. When we separated ourselves from the city of Cloquet, we also separated ourselves from local government aid. We did not receive any of the public safety aid that was distributed last December. Now, a proposed bill would give fire districts access to state funding. I'm here today to testify in support of Senate File 5461, and I wanted to kind of give you a little bit of basis of the impact that this bill would have. Something Buse recently voiced his support for at Minnesota's Capitol, as many communities struggle to provide fire and EMS services. When you take away the municipal boundaries, you can look at what's best for an entire region and you can find efficiencies, you can find a way to collaborate and, and combine your, your staff and your equipment to make it a more effective, more capable response. The Cloquet Area Fire District, which started in 2009, is one of only a handful statewide. Senator Jason Rarick says other departments are looking to make the switch. Many areas around the state have contacted Chief Buse um, looking at their model, but very concerned about the piece of how will they um, their funding be handled. Rarick is one of the authors of the fire district bill. He says it will help both existing and future districts. These consolidations can really help them save money, but yet it still is very difficult for them to make ends meet. So this state aid piece could be a, a very big piece of making that viable. In Cloquet, Jack Wiedner, Northern News Now. Rarick says the bill is making its way through the legislature, but there is a chance it could be tabled until next year.